facility that Pfizer has in the world, uh, and we're proud to be uh, the home of it. Using cutting-edge tech, tech, technology, Life Fuel Cell Energy's project, uh, product helps us in the state uh, where they're based and where they are leading uh, the world in new design of fuel cells uh, and incorporating uh, fuel cells into a number of different uses. Uh, and they're not the only fuel cell company in the state of Connecticut. We are actually a very hot spot for that research and development going on. This technology will obviously make sure that your experiments going on in the building uh, that's in front of me, behind you, uh, don't get interrupted because of weather conditions or, uh, or other conditions that have uh, uh, caused some damage in the past. We needed to self-generate. That was going to be how we could truly commit to the reliability profile that this site and this science needed. We had a problem. We, we did not have enough capacity to self-generate for the full load. We were short by about 4,500 households worth of energy, about five plus megawatts. So we had options, all of them capital intensive. But we looked to and appreciated very much the commitments that Governor Malloy and his administration have made into R&D for alternative energy sources. And in our own state, we had a company like Fuel Cell Energy that had already demonstrated a commercialization ability of something like this. Think of it, we are actually sitting in a cogeneration plant, and you can hear me speak, obviously with a microphone, but we're out in the open. This is, this is profound, um, and it is allowing us to accomplish a few incredible things. One, the reliability profile that John mentioned. Two, Pfizer has made public commitments to reducing our greenhouse gases. We have our signatory to the UN's accord on this. This project, together with many other projects across the globe for Pfizer, will help us achieve those commitments. It's allowing us to be cost efficient in our operation, which means more money to invest in medicines that matter. And it is allowing us to be on vanguard with other great companies and partners like Fuel Cell Energy. Fuel cells support a continuous 24-7 operation. And for the Groton R&D site, it comes down to time. This allows us to eliminate the, any delays in our science and, and speeds our innovations or new therapies uh, to patients in need. In terms of sustainability, this, this site has a 47% efficiency rating, uh, comparing that to your typical generation equipment, which is in the mid-30s, that's a step up. And plus, we're recapturing some of the heat to this to make steam for our site. So that, that brings your efficiency up into the 90s. That's pretty good. That's really good. I'll take that any day. And regarding timeliness, I think we've already spoken about that. We, we signed a contract on December 23rd, and on September 4th, we were making power. That is very fast, so kudos to FCE. Lastly, one, one of the things that we're very proud of is uh, the fuel cells were designed, assembled, operated, and they'll be maintained by a local state business. And that's creating quality jobs in our uh, local economy. So what more can you ask for?